Hello, my name is Sinan. Today I'm going to talk about the useful tips to success in the bad speaking exam. Um, first of all, I, I would like to say that I think I'm very good at speaking, in my opinion. But the problem I have is that when I have an idea in my mind, in my mind, I don't know how to say it because I start overthinking it. I mean, I start adding some other ideas and in the end I get very confused and I don't say anything that I would like to say in that moment. So that's why I think that's my biggest problem. Also with the part that I get very nervous when I'm with the interlocutor. So that's it. I think that's my biggest problem in the bed exam of the speaking. Uh, but I like the tips you give us because, well, in the part three, where is the part I hate the most because you have to describe a photo. Um, so, like I said before, I start overthinking of what to say in that photo to impress the interlocutor and in the end I don't say I don't say anything because I get very uh, very nervous and I get confused so that's why I like the tips you give us of whom or what you can see what is happening the mood what just what has just happened opinion words Whereabouts? It's so simple, but when you are in the test, you want to impress the interlocutor and the examiner, and you say you start overthinking and don't say anything, but you just have to describe the photo. But you know, you get the other ideas like uh, deductions. You start uh, doing deductions that you can do. You can do it, or there's other simple things to do to describe of the photo. That's why that I like the that you give us the important things to say for in that in that part. And and also to finish, um, I like that the part four or tag, of talking with the partner with the partner about ID 